Two o'clock local time, uh, Central Israel experiencing uh, sirens for the first time in many, many months. In Tel Aviv, we haven't heard sirens since January, and uh, uh, other areas have not, have not heard uh, sirens for, near, for about six months. Uh, rockets were fired from Rafa, which is on the southern edge of the Gaza Strip, all the way to the northern outskirts of Tel Aviv. That's quite a long distance, some 110, 120 kilometers uh, between Rafa and those uh, northern outskirts of uh, uh, Tel Aviv. Israeli officials have been warning that it may happen. Why so? As Israel, they say, is deepening its operation uh, within Rafa, Hamas operatives there understand that w whatever they do not fire now, they may eventually not fire as Israel may eventually detect and destroy those or rockets. There is very strong pressure on the government to make a move towards a hostage deal and, and this pressure has intensified over the past week for a couple of reasons. That uh, video which surfaced, which uh, showed uh, the, the kidnapping of five uh, female hostages towards Gaza and also the fact that uh, seven uh, bodies of uh, Israeli hostages were found in Gaza and brought back. Many of them, Israel did not know that uh, they were dead. Uh, up until uh, the bodies were found, Israel was assuming most of those uh, people are alive and the families are saying that if Israel does not act quickly uh, towards a hostage deal, then even those hostages that are still alive in Gaza may eventually come back only as dead bodies. Therefore, there is a lot of pressure on uh, the Israeli government.